All right. He's getting the back full here. I usually like to duct tape my boots or put like a rubber band so I don't get cord in my boots, but. I don't feel like I have that much or if any corn in my boot right now. That's good. Tying off straight because then you can work with both hands. I mean, some guys probably like, I work with both hands without a harness. Good for you. I uh, don't like risking my safety for latching a bin. So that's all locked up. But you, you want to make sure because you get moisture in and you can wreck a lot of corn. It just kind of fought me here on this corner. But it's, she's latched. Free climbing, I don't know. I, I just try to three points of contact. And I feel relatively safe doing that. But when I make the transition up to a different walkway, I like to try to tie off. Switch my feet around here. Wah. A little bit different of a view in the winter. down here right over the top of the truck whoops I'm gonna get rid of this I thought maybe if I was gonna go farther into that bin but all it's doing now is getting snagged on stuff off to go Woo! <laughs> Probably made his heart jump a little bit. It's kind of a cool, I've never been up here on top of a truck getting loaded. There is a uh, video of the layout on the system in my uh, other videos if you want to check it out, but in case you don't want it or whatever, dump pit to wet leg to dryer. Who's yelling? Real good. Real good. <laughs> so dump pit to wet leg to dryer to dry leg to this over to bins right in a rough overview or dump pit straight to dry leg straight to bins for soybeans we can switch that so dusty dusty well like some of the equipment uh get moved around cleaning out pits or whatever cart gets left outside along with a few other things here so 